Greetings, app enthusiasts. Justin Z here with a review of the Whole Foods Recipes app for the iPad. You can see more about this app at mahalo.com slash Whole Foods RV. Whole Foods has come out with a free and handy little app that provides convenient and easy recipes for your cooking pleasure. Basically, the app is divided into sections with a list of recipes on the right-hand side. The search section is probably the most powerful feature. You can type in a name and narrow your search by course, category, and special diet. Be sure not to get too specific or you won't get any results. The on-hand feature is unique in its design by allowing you to make a search based on the ingredients you have at the time. Favorites is a list of recipes you have starred which is available as an option when you perform searches. Locations is simple but very useful because it uses your current location and makes a map of all nearby Whole Foods grocery stores. You can also look at the nearest locations as a list with each listing giving you hours, phone number, and the option to visit its webpage to see in-store specials. Finally, the shopping list is pretty self-explanatory. To add ingredients, you would click on a recipe, then click on the icon in the upper right-hand corner to add the ingredients you need. When you look at the recipes list, along with a specific recipe, you get a series of colored icons. Each icon has a specific meaning, but it is initially confusing to find out what they mean. To get details on each of them, click the special diet button in the search feature. Each recipe is pretty straightforward. You get an ingredients list, directions, how many people it serves, and a picture of the meal. If you like, you can email, Facebook, or tweet the recipe. The app is very practical and has hundreds of recipes to choose from with colorful photos. That being said, I've seen other recipe apps that have a lot more options. It could also use a little bit more open communication with Whole Foods. For example, you can add ingredients to your list, but wouldn't it be especially helpful if each ingredient had a price? A pound of lemons for $3.50, etc. Sure, prices change all the time, and each location has different prices, but if someone were able to update the prices at each Whole Foods, that would make things unbelievably convenient. Of course, that would probably take away the fact that the app is free, but all the same, it would be great. It would also be nice to change the amount of servings for each dish, and the ingredients would change accordingly. Finally, the app crashed on me once in a while, or wouldn't respond to my touch. Overall, it needs a little bit more to make it exceptional, and it has some glitches to fix, but it's a worthwhile addition to your iPad arsenal, especially since it's free. Cookbooks are always a good idea on an iPad. I give the Whole Foods Recipes app for the iPad a 3.5 out of 5. Please be sure to rate, comment, and subscribe below, and send any requests to requests at mahalo.com.